15 Scary Predator Teeth. Number 15, Payara. Much like this saber-toothed tiger, the Payara developed a terrifying set of fangs, enabling it to stalk and dominate over prey in the Amazon waters. The fish can reach up to four feet in length with an accompanying pair of three to four inch fangs. The Payara digs its fangs right through the vital organs of its prey to subdue the animal. Once its victim begins sinking to the bottom, the fish uses its cavernous jaws to engulf the creature. Its fangs remain positioned within its mouth, unlike other saber-toothed animals that usually have their fangs sticking out of their jaws. It makes you think twice about taking a swim in the Amazon rivers where you either have to battle with piranhas or this scary creature. 14. Goosender The unusual bird looks much like other ducks, except for its razor-sharp backward curved teeth. It is the largest member of the sawbills and inhabits Canadian, Eurasian, and American estuaries, park lakes, and rivers. The goosander has more than 150 teeth that can slice through fish with no problem. Birds generally do not have teeth, and instead their teeth-like protrusions are known as tumia. Behaving much like an aquatic raptor, the goosender can on occasion saw up other birds and small mammals. 13. Saber-toothed deer. Who would have thought that deer could be harmful, perhaps frightening, but the saber-toothed deer makes us believe otherwise. Native to Eurasia, the musk deer spot massive fangs that develop as outgrowths of their canine teeth. Their fangs grow to lengths extending a few inches below their lower jaw. Their teeth come in handy during duels between fellow males to settle mating disputes. They are definitely not your average deer that is often hunted for sport, and the fact that they mark their territory with a pungent scent does not make it any easier to hunt them down. 12. The Orca Commonly known by its reputation as the killer whale, the orca is the largest species of the dolphin family. The predator still maintains its position at the top of the oceanic food chain and there are no known animals that prey on the orcas. Their predatory nature extends to hunting down seals and even fellow dolphins. Their powerful jaw maintains a deathly grip on their prey and their strong teeth finish the job. Their upper teeth close into the gaps left by the teeth on their bottom jaw. Number 11, Bull Snake Teeth. Most snakes have four rows of teeth, and some might also have fangs in addition to that. Not the bull snake, which only has a set of teeth that can still inflict serious harm in the form of a painful bite. Like most non-venomous snakes, its solidly fixed teeth feature a backward curve on their bottom jaw and four rows of teeth on their upper jaw. Its mode of attack is digging its teeth in its prey while coiling its body around it to subdue the struggling animal. The teeth keep the wriggling victim going in a backward trajectory towards the snake's throat. It's viewer comment time. We love giving shout outs to our subscribers. For today's video, we're giving a shout out to the Living Freak Show. They commented on our video about creepiest urban legends, and in the video, we asked for people to share stories from their own hometowns. Living Freak Show wants to know if you think their hometown urban legend is real or fake. Let us know in the poll section. Number 10, Narwhal Male. The toothed whale features a single tusk protruding from its canine tooth. It is one of the two known whale species in the world, residing primarily in Russian, Greenlandic, and Canadian Arctic waters. Much like other toothed whales, the Norwals communicate using knocks, clicks, and whistles. Interestingly, the Norwal skull features two tusks, but only the canine tooth on its left upper jaw develops into the male whale's identifiable protrusion. The tusk keeps growing throughout the whale's lifetime and can reach lengths between 4.9 to 10.2 feet. 15% of the female Norwals also grow tusks, but with a less conspicuous spiral. 9. The Atlantic Wolffish Its name says it all. 
And much like the piranhas, you have to keep a watchful eye for the Atlantic wolffish because it can bite. Also called the wolf eel, double fish, and sea wolf, the bottom feeder remains harmless to other fish. They use their enormous jaws to chow down on hard shell creatures like mollusks. In fact, the devil fish is credited with helping to control the population of sea urchins and crabs. Overfishing has threatened the fish and made it quickly fade almost to obscurity. 8. Lamprey Lampreys look much like some creature conjured up for a sci-fi movie. The primitive vertebrates, also known as cyclostomes, look much like cylindrical tubes and they have round mouths. The jawless creatures have sucker-like mouths that they use to chow down on food. The lampreys also do not have bone, but instead they consist of cartilage. They look much like eels and also have a network of uncovered round gill pores on the sides of their heads. They do not have scales and can grow up to one meter length. 7. Hagfish The hagfish is called by several other distasteful nicknames, including the snot eel. It surprisingly lives at the very bottom of the ocean, while it lacks several physiological elements of a fish. Also, unlike other fish, instead of a jaw, it carries a horizontally placed set of teeth like structures. The slime eel uses its horrific-looking teeth to engulf its prey. The hagfish feeds on carrion, tuna, and even the carcass of enormous sea creatures like a dead whale. It begins by lashing itself in a knot onto the bodies of dead sea creatures. The eel then uses its teeth to push back the prey's skin before burrowing itself into their flesh. Number 6. Slugs and the Cone Snails no one ever wants to have to deal with a slug that finds its way inside their house, let alone think about its eating habits. It turns out that slugs do have teeth-like structures known as radula. They have plenty of the radula that pretty much function as their mouth or tongue with sharp points. They use the radula to clamp down on the food they want to eat. Slugs feed on lichen plant carcasses and they do not shy away from eating other slugs. Also on the list of deadliest slimy creatures are the cone snails. The four to six inch long gastropods found in Indonesia, Hawaii, and the Caribbean feature beautiful white and brown marbled shells. The cigarette snail's venomous teeth secrete the deathly conotoxin poison which can cause paralysis and death within seconds. Five, goblin shark. Sharks are anything but cute. But believe it or not, some people have used the word when describing the goblin shark. It features a pale gray color with a white belly, but its semi-transparent rubbery skin makes its blood vessels visible, giving it an overall pinkish tint. The fishermen who come across them often think that they are disfigured. The goblin shark eats crustaceans, cephalopods, and telephods and lives deep down in the ocean, making them relatively harmless to humans. It has a long snout-like protrusion that covers its actual mouth filled with long, sharp teeth. The goblins are commonly referred to as living fossils because their existence can be traced 125 million years back to the Cretaceous period. 4. Penguin's Mouth Penguins are amongst the most adorable creatures you could ever come across. That is, until you take a closer look inside their mouths. They have teeth on their beaks running all the way down to their throats. Penguins swallow their food alive, and the role of their teeth is to inflict as much damage to keep the wriggling prey moving down their throats. Their tongues and teeth-lined beaks work much like a conveyor belt and keep food moving in one direction. The birds only subject their preferred meal, which is fish, to their torturous mouths. 3. Alligator Snapping Turtle the alligator snapping turtle is the evolved relative of the regular snapping turtle. As implied, these turtles can strike fast and in quick bursts when they feel threatened. They still do move slow, much like conventional turtles, but they can take a fierce bite at anyone who encounters them, even if someone's just trying to help them cross the road. The alligator snapping turtles are the world's most gigantic freshwater turtles. They can grow up to 200 pounds, and the largest known was 400 pounds. 
However, unless they feel threatened, the alligator snapping turtles are less likely to bite despite what their names suggest. 2. Port Jackson Shark The Port Jackson Shark has some of the most distinguishable teeth amongst all sharks. Its front teeth are small, pointed, and sharp, while its back teeth are blunt and flat. The Amvipara Shark uses its teeth to hold, break, crush, and grind mollusks and echinoderm shells. Offspring often have sharper teeth, and they feed on softer body prey compared to the adults. Interestingly, these sharks can breathe and eat at the same time, which is something that is unusual for sharks. They usually swim while their mouths are open, which forces water to pass over their gills. The Port Jackson shark pumps water via its first enlarged gill, then pushes it out through its four other gills. That way, it does not need to rely on movements to breathe and can lie at the bottom of waterbeds for extended periods. Number 1. Crab Eater Seal the crab eater seal has teeth that look like they have their own set of teeth. Their scientific name, Lobodon carcinophaga, translates to lobed tooth crab eater. Despite being called a crab eater, the seal does not eat crabs but instead feeds on Antarctic krill. Their mouths feature the unique filter feeding adaptation to sieve through water, ensuring that they only consume the krill. Antarctic krill are some of the most abundantly available animal species so much so that they are also the preferred delicacy for the blue whales. The crab-eater seals also feed on some squids and fish. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to press that subscribe button. Coming up next, 10 creepiest urban legends you hope are just myths. Slenderman, or sometimes Slenderman, is a nightmarish creature with a completely featureless, ghastly white face and head as thin as a toothpick wearing a neat dark suit. He has long, tentacle-like arms and likes to stalk, abduct, and variously traumatize people, typically the young, but that's the only thing known.